Hey friendos, how's it going? It's The Enforcer here once again with another Jersey unboxing. But these you've already seen, but I sent them off to Cookie. Uh, Instagram, Cookie Stitch Jerseys. Uh, reach out to Liam. Liam is, um, if, uh, if I actually did have an official um, um, customizer, of the enforcer it would be cookie what you see back here oh let me let me flip this around here so sorry um, what you see right here are three pieces that I have sent out to cookie over the last couple months that we've been uh, doing business and and stuff like that so uh, this beautiful Aho right here this reverse retro Joe Sackick that looks phenomenal and this Haskinen that the numbers he picked up from the actual customizer for the Dallas Stars. So uh, has all the perforations, the right color, everything. He went above and beyond for this one. So reach out to him, especially if you're in the States, reach out to him, see what he can do. It depends on the jersey, how many layers, all that good stuff. So I will recommend you check out um, his uh, email down there, his Gmail address or his Instagram. Cookie. Cookie is the man. And he got me this box uh, back to me. He's been a busy, busy bee. Heavy, heavy one. There's going to be two in here that are name and number customized and then one that I sent to him that um, he basically future-proofed the jersey for me. And we'll see that when we get to it. So I'm just going to open up this box and we're going to see what kind of goodies we got right here. So um, took him a little bit of time. I know that he took a um, like a trip there in between this time and also holidays. And he also you know goes to school, does all this other stuff as well. He does this as a side project, but man, does he do an amazing job? So if you're not worried about uh, time getting back to you, you know you just send them off and you just know okay I know they're in good hands and I'm gonna get those. Cookies your guy. That's what I did for these three right here and I suggest the same thing for you guys as well oh okay alright so the special one was on the top I'm gonna save that one as last and then we're gonna get ooh, I already see one of them so we're gonna get to this one then, and then we're gonna save this last one here so I wanted a um, oh, sorry I just like came in from that from the uh, from work I'm just so excited to open this here so I went ahead and uh, wanted to get a year one um, Seattle Kraken jersey uh, name and numbered and I know they're not they're not having the hottest of seasons but I wanted to um, have a, a keepsake if you will of the 31st team in the league so I went ahead and decided to get this guy remember this I decided on this guy early on in the season if his uh, if his numbers and his consistency have changed, um, maybe it was because I decided to put this guy on my jersey. So it is a Seattle jersey, but I know a lot of people have gotten uh, their home jerseys done. The the darker one, I decided, you know what, let me be a little bit different. Let me send out my road, my white. So right here is my Seattle white prime green, but it's got geeky on it baby let's go geeky right there and it has that uh, uh he did it to the uh, team specifications for this jersey right here and uh what i will do is i will hang this up then grab the uh, camera and then you guys can take an in-depth look i'm not going to slap these on um because you guys have already seen that if you guys want to see me do the unboxing of this video it is um, it's available there so you can check my my other other ones and also I sent Liam out the patch for the first year and he went ahead and slapped that on there as well so that's on the front there and of course I know that uh, Larry NHL hates them but still got my tags on them too <laughs> so I am going to put this one up and then we'll I'll grab the camera and then you guys can come on and see that one for sure. So there's that geeky and man, these numbers look. Anyway, 
we'll get to that one. And then the second one, um, I he's been banging out a lot of um, these uh, Kraken jerseys. There's been a, uh, an uptick in people wanting to uh, send these out uh, to get them customized. But I wanted to send him a, I wanted to send him one where it was like, okay, you do great work, you do amazing. What's one that you haven't done before? And believe it or not, I was already thinking of one when he replied and I was like, excellent, excellent. So um, we agreed on this one, not knowing we agreed on this one, but I'm excited to have this one back. Hopefully Liam, it was as fun as, um, as uh, to, to apply this and, and to, uh, to do it as it is for me to get this one right now. So this one is a reverse retro. Uh, one from last year and it is it is the uh, wild wing and I decided to get Z grass on that baby oh man look at that look at that customization right there and the other thing oh man look Look at how that name is on there right there. Oh man, does that thing look amazing. Look at that, it's all, all um, embroidered right there. Look at, look at that work that went into that. Oh man, that is amazing. Oh, and these number, all these shoulder numbers, man. Look at that. Damn, I know that there's some people that, that, that kind of hate this style of jersey but i absolutely love it it's something different it's something fun it's out there man that is a beautiful beautiful jersey that i am excited to have back here so there's that one once again thank you cookie for banging out this one right here this looks absolutely amazing so we'll get a deep dive of the embroidery of this one as well and the last one this was one that he decided to do um, just because uh, he had done this for somebody else and he said, I know that you picked this up and I wanna, um, I'm offering this to you if you want to. No, um, no pressure if you don't want it. And I said, nah, dude, let, let's, let's, let's get after it. So this one is my throwback Milwaukee Admirals, but because it is a CCM and it's a replica, it's just heat sealed. But what Cookie went ahead and did is he went ahead and stitched around the logo. If you can see down around the ends, Cookie went ahead and stitched all the way around the logo to make sure that that thing is not going anywhere. That looks absolutely amazing. And I'll show you the inside of this one too so that you can see his handy hopefully you guys can see that but yeah his handiwork of sewing that baby on there is amazing so i am so thankful that cookie decided to uh give a whirl at this one and, and sort of throw the little cherry on the top of this beautiful jersey where i don't have to worry about what's going to happen to this i absolutely love this jersey this jersey is phenomenal i know some people think it looks like C captain crunch on the ice but Man, does this thing look phenomenal. So thank you, Cookie, for banging out this one right here. And now we'll go ahead. I'll grab the camera. We can check out these jerseys, and then I will send you guys on your way. All right, so we'll start with the geeky one. Okay, right there, you see the embroidery of the jersey right there on the nameplate. Nameplate looks really, really good there. Embroidery looking good. But here's the thing that I love, these numbers. Look at how the numbers are done. This right here is just one piece of material on the outside of this one. It's not like the layer is on the, on the inside and you're just stacking layer upon layer. Nah, it's on the outside and it goes all the way around. The, the feel, the craftsmanship you have to do to commit to what you're doing here is absolutely amazing. I mean, look at that. That looks amazing. And then, let me see, let's go on the inside, see what we see. So all we see is just that initial layer out there. But you can see if you look close enough, the other stitching that he had to do to place the darker blue material. 
So he had to apply this first and then he had to get this and apply it all the way around and make sure it all lined up and it went well and then in here too. Excellent job, excellent job there. And then the same thing had to happen with these numbers as well. He had to go ahead and do that now. And of course, if anybody's want, look, here's that Sackic, that one that he did for me as well. Get a quick look at that Sackic. And then what I'll do is I'll give you a quick look at that Haskinen that he did for me and that number. You can, there you can really see the perforations. And yeah, it's only on one side of it and then like right here and then right here, there is supposed to be nothing just like it's supposed to be. Excellent job, but no, now, Let's get to the Z grass right here. Oh man, look at that. Look at that stitching right there. Just zoom right in on that. That looks absolutely amazing. Absolutely a treasure there. Fantastic. Let me zoom out again. And then I'll show you, just to get this with this finite like there's not a much root uh, um, margin for error with this and it just looks, look at that S. That S with the little space in there in between looks great. And then, there we go, you see the 46 there. The fun, playful 46. Man, does that thing look great. And then yeah, just give you a real up close look at that. That looks amazing. Excellent work, excellent work, Liam. I can't say it enough, man cookie this is the type of quality you get when you send out a piece to cookie just letting you guys know cookie is the man cookie knows what he is doing all right well uh we'll back up out of here and then we'll call it a day because i am sweating bricks here i really shouldn't have really should have taken my time coming in because now i look like uh like it's a torrential downpour going on here so i apologize for that everybody so anyway, friendos, once again, now that you've seen Cookie's work, if you uh, if this has swayed you, if you're interested at all, reach out to him. Let him know the enforcer sent you because of these uh, videos that you've seen. And um, yeah, reach out to him. Now I've got five pieces uh, from uh, well six if you include his uh, his modification that he did. For this one here to future proof my uh my sweet throwback admiral's jersey so uh once again reach out to cookie if you're interested at all i know i said i was going to do some uh, prime green some um original uh sixes that are prime greens i still have those here i got two other ones from sports k as well as one from hockey jersey outlet as well uh, coming down the pipeline so look forward to those in future videos and um, yeah just like I say right here I mean what cookie is doing right here is absolutely phenomenal like this one here this is one that I got from um, hockey authentics um, I put this up or I put cookies ones up to something that you send out to uh, a retail to have done like this beautiful a I know like if I wanted one of these old school ones to give to Cookie, he'd bang it out no problem. So um, Cookie knows what he's doing. Cookie's gonna try and get you the best piece that he can. If you have any questions or concerns, reach out to him, but I can vouch for him 100%. So again, that's just me speaking. Cookie's a good dude above board. Uh, ben H will throw his uh, stickers or his uh, his um, uh, business cards into people that are at stateside. Um, um, I know that uh, he's got he's got a good deal there with Ben. Ben vouches for him. I vouch for him. I know that there's probably other people that been interested in. If there's a piece you want to get done, send it off to Cookie. He's going to give it with some good TLC, man. So anyway, friendos, thank you if you've made it to the end of the video. Appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know how you feel about these jerseys if you've got yourself one of these z grasses or if you have one of these as well let me know if you've sent out pieces to cookie let me know what you've sent out to him as well love to hear about it all right friendos take care i'll see you on the next one have a good one take care